Uh, I am Sao Fong, the program leader of the mental health nursing program. Uh, I'd like to introduce you some of the history about our school of nursing. Our school of nursing have the longest history in nursing education. And we are the pioneer for our first full-time undergraduate general nursing program in the year 1990. And we commenced our full-time Bachelor of Science Honor program in mental health nursing in 2009. Um, start from the year 2002, actually we have some collaboration with the hospital authority to provide psychiatric training for our general nurse in Hong Kong to get the nursing registration as a mental health nurse. Our nursing program aims to develop our student professional excellence uh, so that our students can provide holistic nursing care and they can also acquire analytical thinking and develop the global outlook and also establish all around development and lifelong learning. Um, the, you can scan the QR code and then uh, you will know the detail of our general nursing program and the mental health nursing program. And I try to compare the two programs with you all together. So for our general nursing program, uh, we have a high number of student quota is 193 as compared with our general nursing program, we have only um, 70. And in our intake for the next year, we will have a new intake of 78 for the mental health nursing program. Uh, the duration for both the general nursing and mental health program will last for five years. Uh, the credit for the general nursing program will be about 151 and the mental health is 157. Uh, we have a long clinical uh, hours for students for the general nursing is uh, 1,440, for the mental health is 1,640. On completion of our general nursing program, our student can be registered as a registered nurse general uh, with the Nursing Council of Hong Kong. For the mental health nursing, our student can register as a registered nurse psychiatric. Uh, with the different professional, with the different um, uh, professional award, uh, our student will work in different hospital setting for the mental health, uh, the student can work in a major psychiatric hospital in Hong Kong, like Castle Hospital, Kwechong Hospital, and also some psychiatric unit of the general uh, hospital. For the general nursing um, uh, qualification, our student can work in the general hospital in Hong Kong. So concerning the program curriculum, uh, both program require the student to, um, to complete 30 credit uh, of the general university requirement subjects. And also students um, have, the, have to complete the uh, discipline specific requirement uh, for their major. The major will be in general nursing or in mental health nursing. Uh, some students may also consider doing a minor uh, apart from the major. So in our mental health program, we have students completing a major program in mental health nursing and also a minor in psychology or minor in nutrition or minor in, um, in business or computing science, we do have students student have different kind of interests. Uh, this show you the comparison between our two nursing program. For the mental health nursing program and the general nursing program, you find there are some similarity in the program. Uh, students are required to complete some subjects like uh, for the basic applied science and behavioral social science, both program require the student to complete the same subject, like the clinical bio microbiology, human anatomy, human physiology, pathophysiology, and pharmacology. Uh, students have to complete the subjects on psychology and sociology. Uh, the difference of the curriculum between these two subjects is the major area. So for mental health nursing, we have a heavy focus on the mental health nursing care. So our students have to be um, very competent in the communication skill. Uh, they have to to have some kind of good understanding about mental health nursing care uh, in relate to our kind in different stage of illness, like in the acute phase, in the rehabilitative phase, in the community mental health area. Uh, we also emphasize a lot about the mental health education promotion. Our students um, will be trained to be competent in deliver some kind of psych psychotherapeutic interventions for our kind. We also emphasize the importance of public, um, I, I mean, uh, quality and patient safety in the healthcare, in the mental health setting. For the general nursing, um, the curriculum will be more focused uh, on the general nursing care, like, um, like in the child adolescent health nursing, childbearing and family nursing. Uh, students uh, study the general nursing program 
also required to do one subject on mental health nursing. Uh, they, but they spend a lot of, uh, of the uh, theoretical hours on the uh, general nursing care. Uh, when compared these two programs, um, students have to learn about nursing research and they have to complete on a project. In terms of the difference in the clinical practicum, for the mental health nursing uh, program, uh, our students will only spend around uh, four weeks time in the medical surgical nursing placement. And most of the clinical hours will focus on mental health nursing, like in the psychogeriatric area, psychiatric acute care, uh, in the rehabilitative care, in some specialty nursing, like uh, they will have the chance to work in a, a clinical unit, provide care for patients with uh, substance abuse, and also they will work with the, the uh, children and adolescents with mental health disorders and uh, individuals with learning disability. For the general nursing, uh, students will only have about uh, two weeks placement in mental health nursing, and most of the placement will be focused on the general nursing area, including medical and surgical nursing, uh, they will be required to work in the accident and emergency department, in the child and adolescent health, and in the uh, childbearing family nursing, community health. Uh, students will also have experience to work in, uh, in the operation theater and in the gerontological nursing area. We do provide uh, different learning activity for students while they study our nursing program. Uh, they include the classroom-based learning, online learning, and also some laboratory training. Uh, for their nursing skill. So we supervise students in the nursing laboratory. Uh, they're required to do some kind of uh, return demonstration after they learn a particular kind of skill. Uh, in preparing our students for placement, we do offer a workshop before the um, actual placement in the um, hospital. Uh, our students have the opportunity to undertake their clinical placement in local hospital. Uh, during summertime, we do have students uh, have the opportunity uh, to undertake their overseas placement. Uh, this picture show you the nursing laboratory of our uh, school. Uh, we conduct workshop for students to train up their competence in the general nursing skill and also in the mental health nursing skill. So in the pictures, you'll find that the students are learning about the rice to feeding and also uh, some students are learning about the uh, restraint and control for patients who experience emotional disturbance. We have our field placement organized in local hospital and also the community setting uh, in Poly U. Uh, our school also run the Lust League Clinic. In summertime, uh, a, small, uh, a small number of students will have the chance to have uh, the uh, placement in overseas country. So our students, both the general nursing student and the mental health nursing student have the opportunity to be placed in the major mental hospital. This is the uh, Kasofi Hospital. Uh, we have students have the placement in the general nursing setting. Yeah, this is the uh, Kowloon Hospital. Uh, in our integrated health clinic, uh, we have the student um, uh, placed there for both the uh, mental health uh, for the mental health nursing experience. Uh, because some colleagues in our school uh, do see such kinds with some emotional problem in the integrated health clinic, and uh, also we will have student placement there. This is the integrated health clinic. Concerning overseas placement, um, apart from the uh, exchange program offered in overseas, like in UK, uh, in Australia, uh, we do have students have the uh, opportunity to be placed in Chinese mainland. This is the Hongzhou Seven People Hospital, where they have the uh, mental health nursing experience. This is the Beijing, in Beijing, our students have got a good experience there. Uh, we have students placed in Thailand, uh, in Switzerland, and also in Sweden. Besides the theoretical learning, our students do have a lot of opportunity to be involved in the co-curricular activity. Um, they can join different activities offered by the nursing association established by our students. And also those activity offered by student affairs office, the student union. Uh, for example, some students uh, uh, join the Poly U student ambassador program. In the past few years, we do have students um, 
uh, achieve some internal award and external award. We have the Outstanding Student Award um, for the mental health nursing student, general nursing student. In 2018, uh, our nursing student from both uh, the general nursing and mental health nursing um, received the Healthcare Spirit, Up Spirit Award in Hong Kong. On completion of our undergraduate program, our student can also consider doing their postgraduate study with us. Uh, we offer master program and also the doctorate program. For the entry requirement of our nursing program for international uh, students, so uh, for those um, taking the um, international baccalaureate degree, they uh, we require a minimum score of 24. But actually, um, most uh, successful applicants enter our program will have a score of about 30 or above. Uh, for those with a GCA level, we require them to have a pass in BA level or two AL or two AS subjects. Um, Typically, uh, they, the successful applicants are those attend at least a uh, 3B in CA level subjects. Uh, this is the admission figure for the GCE and IB qualification uh, for the entry of this academic year. So when we look at the figure, you find that actually uh, this year, um, the student admit to uh, PolyU are uh, actually having a higher score as compared with those in last year's. There's some additional requirement uh, for international students entered into our program. Our students need to be competent in both written English and Chinese, and also students should be very fluent in oral English and also Cantonese. Uh, we do have students from Malaysia, remember, we, we have students from Malaysia, and uh, she can speak very fluent Cantonese. Uh, in addition, students must pass a health check before clinical training. So you may be asking why we choose poly U nursing. Uh, because actually um, we have the longest history in nursing education. Uh, we are the top three, our school of nursing uh, are the top three leading school in Asia. Uh, we also ranked 31, uh, 31st in the QS World University ranking in 2020. Uh, we pioneer our nursing education. So we are the first nursing school in Hong Kong start our full-time Bachelor of Science in General Nursing program. And also we are the first university have the um, master degree in nursing and mental health nursing. And we have the first um, pre-registration master of nursing program for graduate from other discipline. So for a student graduate from other discipline, like maybe they are graduate from a degree of business or uh, applied science, uh, they cannot consider apply for a full-time three year master program with us and uh, obtain a master degree in nursing and a professional qualification in general nursing. Uh, we have a joint our online program uh, for master uh, disaster management in collaboration with the University of Manchester. Uh, we are the first university to offer the doctorate uh, PhD program and master uh, program. Um, now, up till now, we have produced more than uh, 15,000 alumni. Uh, they're working in different settings in Hong Kong in the high positions. So we have a very strong network uh, with our alumni. So I think that's all I want to share with you about our nursing program.